This is where to find the body count legendary weapon in Dead Island 2. Dead Island 2 has a lot of weapons, like seriously, a lot of weapons to run through the hordes of undead with, but not all of them are created equal. Legendary weapons, as their name might suggest, are the best possible weapons you can find in the game and can turn your average playthrough into an absolute breeze. And they're incredibly fun to use, so you're going to want to find every single one of these zombie slaying mega weapons you can. So with that in mind, here's how to get your mitts on probably the most powerful and easiest to get legendary weapon in the game, the body count assault rifle. So with that in mind, here's how to get your mitts on probably the most powerful and easiest to get legendary firearm in the game, the body count assault rifle, and exactly why it's so good. To kickstart your hunt for the weapon, you'll need to complete the redacted quest. Do a couple of favours for Rodriguez at Venice Beach, or just complete Cremains of the Day and that should do it, and you can pick up the side quest in a small tent to your left when you enter the military barracks in Venice Beach. In it, you'll find the unfortunate Lieutenant Ford, and once you kindly put him out of his misery, he'll drop the redacted item and kick off the quest. It's a surprisingly short quest for such an incredible reward, but in a zombie apocalypse, we aren't going to complain. Make your way back to the tower house and head out onto the beach behind it. There's a boatload of shipping containers out here, but the one you're interested in is 66. Head behind it where you'll find a ton of zombies, including a crusher, and take care of them and make sure you take out Private Delgado. He's your next target. Once he's down, you can pick up his supply case key. That done, shipping container 66 has been helpfully left open for you. So head inside and break apart a few boxes until you reach the back of the unit where you'll find a supply box ripe for the picking. And inside, you'll find your reward, the legendary body count assault rifle. And what you have there is the most powerful rifle you can get your hands on in the game. It comes with a built-in superior ranged puncturator mod which inflicts bleed damage and grants a major damage boost. Successive hits to a zombie apply more and more bleed damage as you go as well, so it turns even large groups into mints without really trying. The tactical reload perk means killing a zombie nets you a moderate reload speed, and since you'll be killing them a lot, it also comes with the perks Exit Wound and Bloodthirsty that inflict bleed on nearby enemies when you hit a zombie, and grant a moderate damage boost and extra fury when you kill a zombie, respectively. All in all, it's the best gun in the game, and since guns trivialise most fights in Dead Island 2 anyway, the body count rifle is an absolute must if you want the end game to go as smoothly as possible. So that's where to find the body count legendary weapon in Dead Island 2. Let us know what's your favourite legendary weapon you've found so far, and check out these videos to help you out on your holiday to hell.